All right, here we go. It's going to be the number 24 car on the pole. That is Carter Brownsberger and the number 24. On his outside, Kyle Lafferty, the number 55. And what I understand, folks, and I believe, if I'm right, Ronnie may have to correct me if I'm wrong, I believe Kyle Lafferty is Ron Muhlenberg's son-in-law. I believe that's the case. If I'm wrong, somebody could let me know. But uh, nevertheless, uh, I was told that Rob Muhlenberg not doing too well. He had a stroke. And so y'all might remember him and his family. Rob Muhlenberg, and I uh, want to remember him and his family. And we're thinking about you, Rob. Hope you can improve and uh, be back at the racetrack with us again. Back to the racetrack, we got Cody Morgan there, and then the number four, row number two, Lafferty on his outside in the number 20. Good starting spot for him. Keep your eye on that number 20 car. McIntyre in the number nine, row number three. On his outside is the Thompson machine, the 929. That is Garrett Thompson. And then back there in uh, row number four, you've got the 166. Pardon me, that is not a 166. 122 Doug Schism. 122 Doug Schism. Pretty bad, I can't tell a six from a two. On his outside, Jonathan Dean in the number seven car. Right behind them in the number 53 car, Jordan Goddard. Lacey Menzi in the number 41. Jeremy Hazel in the number 15. Steve Moore in the 67. Dusty Sanderson in the number 21. Langton in number 35. Green flag's out. And we've got problems on the front stretch, but we may stay under green. Menzi getting together with Jordan Goddard on the front stretch. Looks like everything is gonna stay green as we come through three and four for the first time. Brownsberger is your leader. Steve Moore, again, having problems with the number 67 car. Struggled earlier in the night in the heat race, still struggling with that car. Very unusual for the number 67. Meanwhile, up front, Brownsberger with a pretty decent lead right now over Lafferty. Who's running in the number two spot up on the top side? It's the 20 car. Leahy, he's looking for that number two spot. Thompson running in fourth. Chisholm rounds out your top five. Jared McIntyre working on the top side. Inching ever so closer to that battle for the number four spot. Back in the pack, they're three wide coming off turn number four. Langton on the top side, Morgan in the middle, Hazel on the bottom. And Langton making up some ground on that top side of the racetrack. Langton started in the back, but now has worked his way up to about the middle of the pack. Meanwhile, up front, Brownsberger just blowing him away right now as Dusty Sanderson's having some problems in the number 21. Down on the bottom side, stays out of the way, does a good job there. Everybody gets by. Sanderson, a lap down. Brownsberger, strong in that number, 24. 
Sanderson off the speedway right here on the front stretch. And that's going to bring out a caution flag. Tough break for Dusty Sanderson, the 21. He tried to get that car to the infield and went over the, the hump there and just couldn't quite get it far enough in off the speedway to be out of harm's way. Tough break for the number 21 car. Wow, well the number 24, your leader, Carter Brownsberger. Really got it going on, that number 24, that green flag dropped. He put some distance between himself and the rest of the field. Kyle Lafferty in the number two spot. Jeremy Leahy running in third. Garrett Thompson fourth. Doug Chisholm rounds out your top five. McIntyre sixth. Jonathan Dean seventh. Hazel, ninth, Langton in the top 10 now after starting in the rear. Morgan Walker, Goddard, Menzi, and Moore rounds out your field. Turn number four, they come. Green flag is in the air. And it turns number three and four. Brownsburger, your leader. What a battle we got for the two, three, four, and five spots. As Doug Chisholm goes from the fifth spot up to the number two spot. The 122. On a mission. Lafferty back to third. And the number 20 car having a little bit of trouble now as Shism almost off the back stretch. He'll catch it and hold on to that number two spot. Meanwhile, Jeremy Leahy having a problem in the number 20 car. Running up in the top five, then he was slow coming off of turn number two. Almost thought he was going to take it to the pits, but he didn't. Stays on the racetrack, and he has fell all the way to the back of the field. Evidently a problem for the number 20. Meanwhile, up front, Brownsberger has built a substantial lead over Doug Chisholm in the number 122. Lafferty still holding on to third. Looky, looky, here comes John Langton in the number 35. Check that Jerry Langton. Jerry Langton coming to the front in the number 35. That car looked less than impressive in the earlier heat races. But that car has come to life in the feature and Steve Moore goes around over in turn number four. And that was a close one as well. The leader's coming around and that could have been ugly. Luckily, nothing Nothing big happened on that deal. Tough break for Steve Moore. As I said earlier, that car a little bit off tonight. That 67 car normally runs really well, but 
just having a little bit of trouble tonight. And his troubles continue here in the feature. Here we go, green flag once again. This may be a break for D Doug Schism in the 122. Looked like he was gonna challenge and had some problems on the back stretch. Here we go, white flag is out, one lap to go. Contact between Lafferty and Jerry Langton. Langton down to the bottom, he picks up the number three spot. Browns Burner. Strong into turn number three. Here they come off turn four for the final time. Brownsburger, Schism, Langton. Wow. Wow. What a race, and I tell you what, that number 24 car, as far as I know, I believe this is the first time I remember him being here. I may be wrong about that, but uh, Carter Brownsberger. Carter Brownsberger, and he put it on. Looked like Doug Schism might have something for him, but came up just a little bit short. And I tell you what, I'm not so sure if we'd have had about five more laps, Jerry Langton might have had something to say about the whole thing. Jerry Langton coming from the very back to finish third by half a car length. All right, he's out of the car. Put your hands together for him, Carter Brownsberger. And I'm not for sure, folks, but I, I'm not so sure he can drive a car on the highway. He looks like he's about 14 on this monitor up here. I think somebody said, I think somebody said he might be 15 years old. Nevertheless, that young man put it on him. Nice run there. Congratulations to him. All right, right now you got your legends on the racetrack. Final feature of the night. Here they come off of turn number four. <laughs> 